Ahoy, I'm Swedamax, welcoming you back to some more Let's Play Europa Universalis 4, the extended timeline mod as the Shiva. Where we just averted a major crisis, Peasant War. Lovely. We should actually try to get some claims going. Guess we'll need to war ourselves down to Shushu or something. And I think the next one is going to be Hebei. Wonderful. These guys are handling the new provinces. Very well. Very, very well. That perhaps I should annex them. Right, marriage. Annex to Vessel. Wonderful. That's gonna keep that diplomat busy for a while. But the relations over time. No, we don't have anything better. I have an infinite amount of money though. Thing. Of course, they immediately. And let's improve some relations. Or a marriage? No, they have to offer it. And it doesn't matter because they're already being integrated. The next one is going to be Wooding. Claim. Yeah. Yada yada yada. Hmm. How much will we be able to take? Because I don't want to increase the holdings down here. Number. If we can't. Reach that we should be able. Well, that's pretty close. This is not. But from here, we should be able to jump over the capital. Right. That shouldn't be too far. So, we don't have any causes for like anywhere. Oh, hmm. Wonder, did they become too big? Possible. Greece is quite big as well. And yeah, we should take the early naval tactics. King. So let's celebrate by increasing navy morale. Wonder why we can't go here. We own a province, a region, one of the most valuable, actually. We need to take this. anyone to help with that? No. From our reliance on gold mines. And production efficiency, because why not? <clears throat> How much are we making from trade? Oh, that's quite a bit. Still on 31% of our income. The rest is coming from taxation and production. Gold, 
Music High is giving us free. Let's see, where's that? Oh, that's the wrong button. Also the wrong button. There we go. Gold. Oh, that's right. 36 per year. Recall. And early ideas. I want that so badly. Take it. We will... Okay, well we got to take this. Unjustify the man. Early diplomatic. You wanna sell us that province? Again, you still have Mongol patriots there, so I'm gonna say no. And we have another merchant. And you will be going here, I guess. Transfer trade power. Jejun. All trade is going on. I have a hundred percent. I'm sending everything here. Next one is a diplomat. Definitely use one more. And we should change our focus. Now it'll take 40 months instead of whatever the earlier number were. And we should get some military technology. Lovely. And we're up to our force limit. We should lower our army maintenance. And get another claim on something like Xing Su. Better to just have all the claims. You should go back to there. Lose some ducats because the ducats doesn't mean anything to us. I'm growing very, very fond of this campaign. the battle even though we had no morale did we actually not East Asian raiders show outdated well they are better so I'll keep them I mean that we just got alright fine by me if you've got some anything else that felt weird should probably get a claim here too on all of the provinces basically Get and deal with them. Requesting that I join the war. Sure, I join whatever you, war you want. 
Oh, it was against the Han. Oh, we might be able to get something out of it. Let's increase the army maintenance. Defeated the fleet. I don't think you need to go home. No, it's not even at go home at all. We are winning. Yes. Awesome. You need a general. Perfect. out as many units as we can and deny their old rights. We get another diplomat. Isn't that wonderful? How's the claim situation looking? Oh that's good. Claim on these guys. On Wohut. And the claim on that province. To incite them to offer it to us again. Rebels. There's no one to give them, them to the province. No one to transfer it to from the rebels. I think that's what's happening. That's why the rebels are taking it over and over and over and over again. Makes no sense. And we came to the province. <clears throat> uh, march to the capital. Unfortunately, this might give us a truce. And I don't know how much we can trust the AI to give us what we want. Oh, they're losing the war anyway. So. We just need to get down there and get individual war score against the war leader. I can say, wait, this is an important trading port. What's it called? Hangzhou. Oh. The city as well. That's what I was looking at. You can see the province name there. We don't recall ever hearing that before. Get some more base tax. Get some base tax is awesome. Even though what we're always looking for is more manpower. Oh no, have we unlocked new? This idea system is kind of weird, <clears throat> but kind of good. Both at the same time. You, I'm gonna be Tibetan. You are gonna be sorry, you get on. Perfect. Good. Let me see. your fun shenanigans. Oh, that's a lucky one. That's just a seven percent chance.
and we'll go down there, crush them. The problem with this is that we're taking care of the Han rebels for them. I don't want to do that. White peas, are you kidding me? I just fought side by side with you for a white piece after occupying half of China. That's just annoying. I think this might have been from the Buddhist rebels, actually. I don't recall them having that. Might be mistaken. And that reset the timer. Someone naval force limit. We will gain 10 military power. And increase our merchant fleet by 5. Two, three, four, five. And I think it, we still can't reach this. Yeah. These are quite good. any more policies, or any new policies rather, take them. It worked. Well, it was an interesting war. Problem is that they're not a challenge anymore. I want to go to war with these guys, preferably both at the same time. Suitable challenge. Did I miscount? No. There we go. Gather up. You will go to Beijing as well. Because why not? 88% trade power. According to this, I have a 90% trade power. Why is that? No way. Eighty eight ninety. <clears throat> Why are you showing me different numbers and which one is correct? That's frustrating. Income minus nine percent because it's the classical error. And you don't have the classical error. You're minus thirty four percent. That's interesting. Well, on that note, I think we'll end this episode here. And if you enjoyed watching, please hit the like button, that's what it's for. If you want to see more in the future, please subscribe. Also, have a nice day, evening, night, whatever suits you the best. And I'm looking forward to seeing you next time. Bye-bye.